In today's video, I want to show you the difference between the one-man tent and the two-man tent. The size and the space difference. And also, I will explain to you why I decided that I want to go for the bigger tent. So this is my one-man tent. And uh, we're not going to talk about the brand. Not yet. And also, uh, there is no cover. We don't need the cover because all I want to show you, I want to show you how much space is inside the tent. Okay, now I'm getting inside the tent and how you can see the tent is very, very small inside. Basically, there is no space. And if it's a very rainy day, bad weather outside there, yeah, and uh, you need to cook your food. There is no way that you're gonna be able to cook inside. So you will have to cook outside here, in this little corner here. There's a little bit of space, but there is nothing what you can do inside. And uh, for me, it's kind of a problem because I like to have a little bit more space for the comfort. So that's why I decided that I will keep this tent, I will use only for the stealth camping because it's really very small and uh, it's compact. Okay, let's compare now with the two-man tent. So this is a one-man tent and this is a two-man tent. Look at the size difference. And it's not only outside, but also inside. Let me show you how much space you have inside the tent. So I can get it into this tent without any problem. I can sit inside this tent. I can sit. My goodness, look how much space. I never had a two-man tent. I'm always, uh, always using the single one, but this is like, a, I don't know. <laughs> it's a miracle for me. I cannot believe how much space. Oh, look. That's crazy because I can actually I can bring my I can bring my backpack look without any problems and it's not only that I can bring a table Look if I want to cook I can bring a small camping table and I can cook inside this is my table inside. This is my backpack. I can push this table on the side and I can chill. I can proper chill. Wow, I'm really happy with this tent. And the space, wow. I never had that much space in the tent. So that's why I cannot get used to it, but I'm loving it, absolutely loving it. But of course, there's the downside of having a two-man tent instead of one-man tent, and I will explain you right now. Okay, so now let's talk about, uh, about the downside. Well, it's not really a big issue for me, but it could be a big issue for some people. Single-man tent, yeah. So the brand is a Gellert. It's a budget, it's a very cheap brand, yeah? Well, I've been using it for quite a few years and uh, it does the job, it does the job. It's not that I'm using the tent too often because sometimes I'm just using a top um, instead of the tent, but for me, it's enough. So there is many different brands, yeah? And uh, of course, it depends from how deep is your pocket and how much money you wanna spend. But the biggest problem is probably a weight. So this single man tent weight, 1.8 kilograms. It's heavy. For the single man tent, it's heavy, definitely. Okay, so the two man tent, it's again, it's same company, same brand, the Gellert. It's cheap. <laughs> I paid basically nothing, almost nothing. It's a mongoose to now this two-man tent 
it's almost three kgs. I think it's like 2.9. So that's another extra kg on the top. We all know very well that if you go on the long hiking trips, every single kilogram in a backpack will start getting heavier and heavier and heavier and heavier. So that's why people go for the lighter stuff. For me, I don't have an issue because I'm kind of used to carry a lot of stuff in my backpack and uh, I'm not really complaining about, uh, about the weight. Now I will give you a little bit of information. It's in numbers. Yeah, so basically what you can get, if you will decide that you wanna go for the two man tent instead of the, of the one man tent, and uh, I've got my notebook because I'm getting old and my memory is not that good. So basically, if you're gonna go for the, for the budget one, they're all gonna weigh almost same. You can get between 2.4 kilogram and a three kilogram. Yeah, it's a Vango Banshee 2 and the OX Jackal 2, um, OX Fox 2. Yeah, they all weight very, very, very similar. Very similar, yeah. But then if you wanna go for some high-end tent, uh, if you got the money, if you got the money to spend, I don't have money. So you can go for like MSR, Huba Huba NX, that's 1.7 kilogram. So it weighed less than my single man, one man ten. Yeah, so two man ten weighed less. Uh, and also MSR is like 500 pounds. That's like $630 for all my viewers from the States. But the best one, what I found, I found it's a Terra Nova Laser Compact 2. Yeah, I was shocked with the weight, yeah. It weighs, it's a two-man tent and it weighs 1.28 kilogram. <sighs> what? The price is almost 600 pounds. It's like over $700. But two-man tent, one kilogram and almost 300 grams. <sighs> wow. That is crazy. Well, hopefully one day I will have this like 600 pounds to spend on this, on this tent. But at the moment, I'm really very happy and pleased what I have. This two man tent, I, I'm telling you, it will make my life much more comfortable. And now I'm really looking forward to go and use this tent in a, in the field, in a you know wilderness, in a real camping you know situation. It's not like just check this uh, tent in my garden. But my advice to you, if you like a bit more comfort, if you don't mind carrying a little bit more weight, yeah, or if you have a bit more money in your pocket, get a two man tent instead of the one man tent. Because I'm telling you, it's a life changer. At least for me, at least for me. Okay, anyway. Thank you very much for watching and as always i will see you all in my next video you all take care